In this tutorial, I will show you how the app works in details. But in order to get started, I want to give you some general information about the app. Actually, the app is found on the Play Store, so you can download it and test it as much of, as you want before that you buy this course. The app generally is about task management, so a company can upload a task and assign it to the workers, and the workers can add comments to it. At the meantime, the app can be used as a social network also. The workers can communicate to each other through WhatsApp, phone calls, and even emails. So we can get started now. As you can see, we have this login screen and the user can sign up. The user must pick up an image. So let's pick up an image. And once I pick up an image, it will force me or I can, for, I can crop it or I can keep it to the original, okay? So you can rotate it, you can crop it, you can do whatever you want. Okay, as you can see, it appeared in here once I pick it up. Let's go back. And in here, the user also can forget his password. He just needs to enter his email. We also have some error handling. So this is not valid email address. So once I try to reset the password, as you can see, I got an error. Hit OK. And now I will try to sign in. And let's see what will happen. So I try to sign in now. So here is the main screen. And if the user is already logged in, this screen will be displayed directly. We don't have to show him the login screen and force him to log in once more. So in this screen, the user can apply a filter. So if he wants to see only the business tasks, for example, he just needs to pick up the business task and only business tasks will be displayed. Same for the programming, same for the others. The user can also cancel the filter. As you can see, once I cancel it, all tasks has been displayed. The tasks also has been ordered by date. We are showing the newest first. Great, so the user can also delete tasks. For example, if I long press on this one, a dialog will appear. And if I press on this one, I can delete it. But in our case, we only allow the users that upload this task to delete it. So not everyone can do it. Hit OK now. And if I press on it, it will take me to a details screen. This details screen has all the information about a task. As you can see, the user that uploads this task has been, his name is here and his image URL and his position at this company. Here is the task title, the when it's being uploaded, the deadline date, and if it is exceeded or not. In our case, today is August 4, and this task has been, I mean, the task deadline was on 31 July. So it's been exceeded. So the user also can change the done state, but also not everyone can do it. Only the one who uploaded this task can do it, but all the users can add a comment, but first, here's the description of this task. As you can see, here's the description. And as you can see, the users can add comments. Now, if I press on this add a comment button, as you can see, we have this cool animation, which has revealed these widgets. So in here, let's say, hello, this is a new test. And once I hit post, it directly appears in here, as you can see. Great, so this is perfect in my opinion. And if you have other suggestions, you can tell me and I may take it into consideration. Now let's go back and we have a drawer in here. For this drawer, now we can actually, I converted actually the app to a social app to share more knowledge to you. So in here, I can see my account. I can log out from here. And if I press on this button, it will take me to a new page, which is, will allow me to edit my information. Let's go back. And 
here's all of the information about me appears in here let's go back in here all the registered workers appears in here okay so if I want to visit this user profile for example as you can see all the information appears in here but the logout button it doesn't appear while these three buttons appears in here if I press on this icon it will take me to a browser it will ask me to download the whatsapp to contact this phone number the user can also reach each other by calling here's the phone number of the user and they can reach each other by pressing on the by contacting each other by email for example here is the user job and here is when he started his job here is his email and his phone number and here is his image url and as you can see the design is perfect let's go back and now let's try to add a task for sure the tasks and everything is being connected to the firebase and being fetched from the firebase so now if i choose task for example i will choose accounting accounting title let's say and then description in here if i try to upload i got an error because i must pick up a date in here and only a future date can be picked let's choose this one and in here description of an accounting task let's say let's try to upload it as you can see once it's being finished uploaded a toast has been appeared let's go back to the all tasks and here it is the first one as i said the newest first i can delete it if i long press on it but let's see the details first here's the test two that i logged in with a designer and here's the image and as you can see in here we still have time i can change the done state in here and if i go back i can delete it simply okay in the future i will add other features to it so such as searching for example and more other features depending on your requests so see you soon in the next tutorial